Hi everybody, this is AJ with Car Inspected. Today we are in Vaughn and we're looking at this 2013 Audi A4. Looks pretty good, no major issues. Body all looks nice and straight. No major damage or accidents were detected. There are some small things, small dent on the roof there. For the most part though, exterior body looks pretty good. There's also a little rub on the back bumper, right there. But like I said, it all looks pretty good. Looked at the windows, they all look to be original. Here's a VIN verification, by the way. And it does have uh, 129,905 kilometers on it. Brakes, tires, look at the start of the front, front left. Up here we find a 2017, and it does have about 5, 30 seconds of tread left on it. Looking okay. Little chewed up on the edges, but nothing too crazy. Brakes in the front look good. Rotors are nice, fairly new, no, no big uh, lips or anything like that. Pads, pretty new. Underneath we find suspension components look pretty nice. I don't see any ripped boots, any major leaks, anything like that under here. No signs of major damage. See this is hanging down a little bit, but other than that, doesn't seem to be an issue. Go over to the right front, and we find matching to the other side. Well, it's the 2015, so it's a different year, but it is the same company. Tires, a little, little more wood here. I think there's four 30 seconds in here. We do see some dry rot in these as well, so they are getting a little older. Treads are okay, but like I said, there is a bit of dry rot in there, and you can see the edges are a little worn. Brakes are similar to the other side, looking good. Front pads look decent. Same thing, pretty new. Probably 85, 90% left. Suspension wise, I see no issues under here. All looks pretty good. And again, rust, leaks, anything like that. Don't see any real big issues underneath here. Looks like it's been oil sprayed. No major issues. Looks pretty good. Same thing in the rear, suspension components. A little surface rust, but for the most part, they look pretty good. Rear tires have about 4 30 seconds on them. They're also a bit dry rotten. As you can see, these ones are a little older. Both back ones are from 2011. So they are a little older than the car. Rear brakes, rotors have some rust from sitting, but a little bit of, a little bit of uh, gouging, but not too much. Pads are a little lower than this end. You see they're a little bit lower. I'm going to give them probably 40% or so left. No leaks in the rear, any issues like that. Looks good under here. Right rear is also a 2011. Date is on the inside, so I can't show you in the video. I had to climb under to see it. But these are also a little cracked and about 430 seconds left. So they are missed, the rear tires are mismatched to the front. Rotors, a little bit of gouging going on. Some situation, these rear pads are a little low. About, I think I said 40 on this side. I'm gonna change my uh, number to probably 30. A little bit of rust right there in that support that you can see. Other than that, underside looks good on this side. Do a quick interior. Trunk looks pretty clean. No major issues. Spare tires there. 
all looks pretty good, nice and clean. Pick that up later. Interior also looks pretty clean. Nice saddle, beige colors. I don't see any major issues. Seats look good. Seat belts are nice. Everything looks pretty good in here. No major stains on the headline or anything like that. Carpets are nice. Passenger side looks good. Again, seats are good. Go to the passenger side front. You find the same situation the rest of the interior. All looks pretty nice. Seats are good. Everything is pretty nice. Carpets look good. Dashboard, again, nice. Find no faults with the interior. Has all the original Audi paperwork in here, along with the lug, wheel lug key. So that is all good. Go to the driver's side. We got no issues here. Everything looks pretty nice. Carpet, seats, all looks pretty good. Dash looks nice. Center console, everything looks pretty nice. Gonna pop the hood real quick. Looks pretty clean under here. Don't see any signs of rust or real issues here. Belts look good. Hoses look good. Everything's pretty clean. Except we do have a little bit. I'm going to take this engine cover off to show you. We do have a bit of a valve cover leak, valve cover gasket leak going on. You can see it on this side and on this side. We do also have a bit of a leak on this front timing cover and the sensor here. I don't know if you can see the video. I got pictures are a little better, a little bit of leak coming from here, bottom of this. And yeah, there is some oil around the turbo area, as you can see all around there. So we do have a bit of oil leak to note. Other than that, though, it seems to run good. About to take it for a test drive and make sure it drives well. Once again, this is AJ when car inspected. And as usual, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.